Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Blog Center, the home of Nigerian African Boxing. And please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now. So, the unified every king of the universe in a surprise occasion defeated and literally destroyed Tyson Fury. You know, we all thought Fury is this trash talker that would... I remember me and my Ojo having a, having a very deep conversation about Tyson Fury's trash talk. You know, I, I was saying, listen, I said, uh, just was, you know, engage in trash talk, uh, trash talking with uh, Fury because Fury is a natural trash talker. But to my surprise, the unified every king of the universe after Fury led the fans on, betrayed the boxing fans, and, uh, you know, really showed his true colors. Joshua called him a fraud. He said, I quote, Tyson Fury, the world now sees you for the fraud you are. You've let boxing down, you lied to the fans, and let them on. Use my name for clout, not a fight. Bring me any championship fighter who can handle their business correctly. You responded by saying, Anton Joshua, your mouth full of shit. That Eddie, Spartan absolute shite. Your full team knew there was an arbitration going on. It was out of my hands. But I tell you what, if I'm a fraud, let's fight this weekend. Bad knuckles till one man quits. Let's put up 20 mil ish. Joshua responded by saying, If there was an arbitration going on, why announce to the world we are fighting? The fire was signed on this period. Bad knuckle, you're a good kid. Don't play with me, Luke. I will slap your bald head and you will do nothing. Waste man. Fury came back saying, not going into the details online, you will slap me about, will you dozer, dozer, please come back and try bomb, I'm waiting, Femi aka bottle job, 247, 365, ready, I will smoke water first, then you will get yours as well. Joshua of course responded later on was, and uh, you know, completely, you know, like, just destroy Fury in trash talking that. I would I did not expect to see that. That was amazing. And of course, the recent um uh scenario, the recent uh, case is that the recent uh, like let's say recent things going on right here. Smashed. When I say you smashed, know, I mean, smash signing uh the fight contract, you know, against Deontay Water in less than three days. It's crazy, man. Let's take a look at it right here. Wilder, contract signed. You're getting smashed. When I say smashed, I mean smash, smash, smash. Bang! You get knocked out. End of one round. You're going. I've got your soul, your mojo, everything. I own Super you. Smash. Super smashed. Sign here. That's a man. Wilder, contract so, signed. You're getting you smashed. So what happened? What do you make of this, bro? Uh, Tad Jagway. Joshua destroying Tyson Fury. How was it like the first time you saw Joshua destroy winning heart on Fury and destroy him completely? It's just, um, it's just a little taste of what was to come for Tyson Fury. You could tell Joshua, you know, the guy, he's pumped, he's ready. He just wants to, you know, just unify already. But I... It's funny because AJ did say, right? The man did say himself. Don't believe what anybody says about this fight unless it, you hear it from my mouth. You hear me announce it. That's when you know it's on. 
when Tyson Fury announced that fight, everybody fell for that shit. I did not. Because I'm like, I'm going to wait for that man I believe in. And unfortunately, I didn't hear anything. And I figured, I guess this fight is not, is not, yet, is not yet finalized, a done deal. Because AJ didn't announce it, but Tyson Fury did. For some, that is, that is exceptionally wrong to lead the fans on like that. Very, very wrong. Because everybody was waiting for that fight. Everybody. And then he did that to boast himself. And that, that's, that's, that is not right. And uh, you're not, if, fool me once. Shame on you. Fool me twice. Shame on me. You know, fool me three times. Come on, man. I don't know who the idiot is, me believing in you or you announcing it. So when, Ty when Tyson Fury, listen, I've said it over and over again. Tyson Fury can, listen, Tyson Fury just put a pen, a pen to paper with saying he, he's, he's ready to fight. I don't believe that crap with Wilder. Saying he's ready to fight Deontay Wilder. Unless I see that idiot in that ring that night that that fight is the date that that fight has been given, I won't believe it. Want to know why? Because he's pulled out of a fight in the past. He's made it lies in the past saying he will fight. He's done it over and over again. It's nothing new. Unless I see Tyson Fury stepping into that ring. I, I don't even care if he's walking towards that ring. He must be in that ring. His glove. He must, he, he must have bumped fist with uh, Deontay Wilder and the ref must have said fight. If I don't see that, Tyson Fury ain't fighting and he's a liar. I do not, from, from here, from, 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 the, from, from, the, from the day that Tyson Fury announced that fight with Anthony Joshua is the day I stopped believing, believing in him with his, uh, with his lies. But when he said all those, I was like, it's this guy, man. I don't know how the UK put, I don't know how the UK put up with him. Because he's a complete bullshitter of a liar. And I'm, I'm for one, I'm not dealing with it. And I can see why a lot of these fans are, um, uh, are basically uh, uh, on, 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 on Deontay Wilder's side, you know? They're, all of them are on Deontay Wilder's side. They want to see Tyson Fury pay for it, you know, get his, ass, get, his, get his ass beat, basically. So, at the end of the day, there's, there's one guy who's been keeping his promises and who's been truthful to you from day one. Truthful to everybody from day one. He has not lied to anybody yet as, a, as, as between the two, Wilder, Tyson Fury, and AJ. There's one person who's been telling the truth. And that guy's Anthony Joshua. He has not tell, told one lie. But between Wilder and, and Tyson Fury, those guys, those those them two have been the one with the continuous lies. And I, for one, you know, I'm going to stick with the guy that has been telling me the truth. So when it comes to people, when it comes to telling the truth, I think, I think, uh, I think AJ, AJ takes that. And the person who takes, who, and the person who continues telling the lies is Tyson Fury. And I think his time, it's over. I, I don't think anybody believes his word from now on. It doesn't ever matter like what, if he's telling the truth or not. I, think, I I just didn't. I, Tyson Fury is the biggest con man to come out of uh, uh of, of of UK. Con man Tyson Fury, the can man and can't lie to you. Got nothing else. Thanks, brother. It was nice to see Joshua defeat uh, Tyson Fury in trash talking. I never believe my eyes. Amazing man. Thanks, brother. I do appreciate you, guys. Status for my exclusive bankers right here. You know. Is boxing related at the home of Nigerian Africa boxing? And shout out to those that have been supporting me from day one and to those that keep supporting the channel. God bless you all.